right. here is a game that sadly has disappeared. Dedicated Rally X's are just not anywhere. I love this cabinet because it's got a very small footprint. It's actually a lot thinner than the Miss Pac-Man and Galaga's. Probably by two inches. And you know, two inches is a big difference, isn't it, Frank? Not for you, it isn't. 20, maybe. Rally X is the first in two ways. Two ways. It's the very first arcade video game to have background sound while you're playing. And number two, it's the very first game to have a bonus uh, race or a bonus screen or challenge rack. Of course, Galaga followed soon after, but remember, this is November 1980. Now, I understand they had this big show, and the three top picks at the show were in no particular order Battle Zone, Rally X, and Defender. And all the executives predicted Rally X would be the number one huge hit. And of course we know that didn't happen. Defender was. I think they made like 40,000 Defenders or something. There's no production counts on Rally X, so we don't think there were too many. Uh, uh, tons of them made. It would be nice to know. This was also the first cream-colored cabinet. And we've matched the color very close. Uh, uh, I think it's pretty much identical. We put white team molding on it. We thought that set it off. You could also use orange, but we thought the white made it really look nice. Look, new control panel overlay from this old game. That's right, they sell it. Marquee was almost perfect. And this, of course, was the earlier Bally games that were lit by regular screw-in light bulbs. We have 40 watt light bulbs up there. But in the back, that's the neat part. We got rid of the extra transformer you needed with that extra stupid power supply. You know what, Frank? I'm going to show you what that power supply is. Watch this. <laughs> Look at this thing. Three, three voltages, okay, if need be. But, uh, and it's still good. It was still mounted in the side. But we got rid of it, and we put a nice, dependable, smaller power supply. It's actually more powerful. And we got rid of that big transistor or transformer with all the wiring and all the nonsense. It's gone. But we left the sticker. See, it still says Rally X UR for upright. Actually, Frank, look. See, the cabinet sticker's still here. It was relabeled. <sighs> and apparently, from what I could see, this here for our settings one car games 10 seconds, 15 seconds. That's actually how it came still there and we'll sell this on eBay a working power supply for somebody who doesn't want to rewire their game okay come on up front let me tell you some of the really great points about this and I show you know what Frank just thought I was in a race similar to Rally X would you like to see the footage well I'm gonna run it anyway here we go you, sir, my unbounded admiration. Thank you. Mm, you know something about champagne, sir? <laughs> Have a shot. If you tell me that the bubbles tickle your nose, I shall probably kill you. Comes again, sir. Have a shot. I'm not a cowardly man, but I am beginning to sense that that thing is out to get me. Now, now, none of that, sir. We're not losing our nerve, are we? Last you, have a shot. How dare you patronize me? I am not losing my nerve! No, sir, of course not, sir. No, no. <sighs> yes, that's Disney's The Love Bug. I couldn't resist. And I'm going to show you at the end of the video how the race ends. I'm going to win, of course. Now let's see if I can win this one. That loads the game in. There's my maze. That's what I have to hit. Do you see the yellow flags? Well, here's the thing. They're all worth points, and they go up 100 points each time. But one of the flags is special. It has an S next to it, and it means it's, everything's worth double. So if I hit that, all of a sudden, my score goes nuts, because I get two times for every time I hit a flag. Now look, I got one more at the bottom. Do you see here on the screen? I'm in trouble now. There's the double one. Did you see it? 
Now, everything I hit from now on out will be worth double until I get killed. Got 900. One car left. There's one flag left. Frank, can I clear the screen? Or Probably not. Frank, I actually have a little cabaret at my house. Right actually, here's down. a picture of the different models. Isn't that nice? So there's three different ways you can buy Rally X. By the way, we still have a cocktail Rally X next door for sale. If any of you want a tabletop version. So, oh, there's the S. Do you see the S? I'm gonna try to go back and, oh. No, I'm not gonna get it, Frank. Now, look at your fuel gauge at the top. Do you see your fuel gauge, folks? All right, I'm gonna use my brake. See, I was able to, Get those people away. There's that S again. Now, the problem is. You don't know how to drive? Frank, I didn't do too well. I didn't do well, too well. Unfortunately, your viewers aren't expecting much, so you're all right. It's such a good game. And I have my own little mini. And look, here's another little mini that we just started on a little asteroid. It's another cabaret. Are you better at this, Frank? Come on. Oh, I can push the button if you want. Nope, there it look, look, he's doing good. Better than I thought. See, look at that. Now, I guess you can hear the background sound playing along. So. Now, somebody called this the Pac-Man of racing games. I think I read that post someplace. There's that double one. Now every flag Frank can hit. See, I helped you out, Frank. I was the one that pushed that button. He still gets it off. I, I, I did push Go it. Go in and drop the ball. I did push it. I pushed it. I just pushed it in. The good news is he gets a new fuel tank full of gas. And he gets points for all the gas not used. All right, good. Frank, you're doing great. You were so you just watch you and learn what not to do. But now there's five cars, Frank. Oh, there's that double. Frank got the double early in the game. You see? Oh, come on. Well, you went right into him. You're supposed to hit the button. You're supposed to be able to navigate him. What happened? Well, you, you went right into him. Hit the button. I, I'm trying to not waste your gas, but I, I'm right here ready to push, Frank. I'm ready to push, baby. I got a solo go card. I can get gas. Oh! oh. Well, I couldn't stop. Oh! Oh, you uh, did it! The uh, high score of the day. You don't keep playing though, they just want you to put another quarter in. All right, take the camera, I'm gonna practice. Well, you know, Frank, we can go to the end of the race where I win. And I have to apologize to Dean Jones. Bless his soul, he's gone. But what a great movie that was. So let's go back to the love bug. We're still waiting for our first glimpse of the leaders. Good old sir, good old, you can't lose. 